Captain's log. Star date. I. I don't even know what day it is. It's been. Thirty days. Maybe more since I've made any contact with anyone on YouTube. I've run out of supplies. I've been scrounging for food. I, I'm down to the last of what I have, what I've been able to find. I, the last two days I've been living on a five-year-old can of squirt and some dried ramen. Oh God. I'm slowly healing. My sanity slipping away. I don't know how much longer I could do this. If you're seeing this, please. Please tell my family that I love them. And that I was thinking of them until the end. That, 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 that's fake news, okay? I don't believe you. I only believe Dr. Fauci. Dr. Fauci. Dr. Fauci! Dr. Fauci wants you to take out the trash. Okay. Well, welcome back to Midlife Crisis. Welcome back, everybody. Oh, my God. Welcome to, to Midlife Crisis. It's great to see you. You know, I've, I've, been, doing, I've been doing okay. You know, life's been, life's been good. <laughs> it's been treating me really, really well, you know. So, anyway, I'm glad to have everybody back, and uh, welcome to the channel. God, I just missed you so much. I just need a hug. I just need a hug. Oh, I miss you. I miss you so much. <laughs> enough. 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 Okay. All right. All right. Enough. 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 I'm done. I'm done. Okay. I'm gonna pull my shit together. Okay. Just, just give me a few minutes, guys. I'll be right back. Just give me a second. And I'm going to pull my shit together, and we're going to make this thing happen the right way, okay? Thank you so much for being here, and just give me one second, okay? I'll be right back. Hey, what's up, guys? I'm back. Okay, so let's get this thing started properly. Thank you so much. Welcome back to Midlife Crisis. I really appreciate you guys being here. Thank you so much for your patience. All the craziness that was going on this last month was a little nutty. So it looks like I've got things stabilized. So uh, I can hopefully be getting these things out to you at least, uh, you know, once a week. So anyway, let's get started. Let's get moving. I've got a little something that I wanted to uh, show before we get to uh, the usual, you know, pictures of the site. See what's going on. There's some activity. There's actually some activity going on over there. So um, anywho, I... If you've watched my channel before and you've seen some of the other videos, you know I like to do a little historical perspective from time to time, do a little thing. Well, I was over there, I was taking some pictures, and I realized there's some stuff there that I think maybe would go unrecognized, and I wanted to recognize it. I think it's kind of important. There's the site, even though it wasn't being used for building ships or being, you know, building rockets or whatever, was still actually being used in a creative way, and it's the graffiti. There's some pretty amazing pieces there, so I'm just doing a quick little piece, just a couple of minutes long, just to kind of, you know, go over and appreciate some of the artwork of SpaceX LA Park. So enjoy this real fast, and I'll be right back. Thanks. Okay, we're starting on the, uh, by the Southwest Marine Building on the far left-hand side of the property, so it gives some perspective of where everything is. Let's look at some art. Coming up on the power building, there's the power building right there, and I gave this for perspective as to kind of where we're going to be at here. A couple of little tags, so I wanted to give this so you could see what's down this alley. Now that is a really nice piece. There's actually two separate pieces on the same wall. They look fantastic. Um, I'm 
not really sure. We'll get in here a little bit closer. I'm not sure who the artists are, but I think it's really, really beautiful. The first piece that we get up on here is, I think it's Lazarus. I'm having a hard time distinguishing what that one says, but I love the color. I love the form, the bubble work, I um, mean, just the shading. I really think they did an amazing job. This looks like there's eight artists. I'll go further into depth on that one in the next video, but look at Spark. I love this one, especially for SpaceX. I mean, come on. It looks like stainless steel and it's Spark. Are you kidding me? If I were Elon, I'd say that. I'd break that wall off and put it somewhere, you know? A Doom, we're going to see another piece from him later, which is amazing. Amazing. I couldn't really make out what this, what this one said, but I love the color. I love the black and the gold and the purple. Skull, really nice. And I'm not sure of an MET5, but again, you know, a little shading. Not the not the best piece, but okay. And this is uh, Coates. Coates is really cool. He worked on this next piece with Boom, but this next piece is amazing. Okay, so this is what it actually looks like from the outside. Okay, so you're looking at it. It looks a little odd. It looks a little strange. I understand why. I was trying to figure it out at first too, and then I realized, holy moly. It's reverse perspective. He, he flipped the image. So once you get to the seeing the image the right way, you have to actually take a picture of it or look at it in a mirror. But once you do that, you get this. Doom Ride. And not only that, it looks really, really cool because you can see the little face with the, the O's and the ride is actually falling down the stairs. I just thought that was really cool. Reverse perspective, everything, and, and the way he put it together. Really, really nice. I dig it. I really, really like this piece. A lot of thought went into that. And last one, I believe, is Ants up here, and it's all the way up on the tower. So, yeah, there it is, guys. Some of the artwork of uh, SpaceX LA. So, there it is. The artwork of SpaceX LA Harbor. I personally think there's some really cool stuff there. I'm actually going to make another video that's going to be posted later on in the week, just kind of exclusively going over each piece, seeing the artist's name, doing some interpretation of color. I... I just think some of those pieces are really beautiful, and there was some thought that went into that. So I agree to disagree, but that's the great thing about art. Uh, some people appreciate it, some people don't, but I do. So anyway, let's get let's get moving. Let's get to the good stuff. Um, let's go right now. Meet me at the harbor. Bye. <laughs>